What's up y'all and welcome back to my channel. As y'all see by the title, this is a self-care routine and we're starting off with these press-on nails. Look at my nails y'all. They've been looking like this for a couple weeks and I'm like, you know what? Let me go get me some press-ons, do my nails. It's super easy, simple, and affordable. I usually get the short French tip, but I wanted to try the coffin shape just to switch it up a little bit. And they're super cute and matte. They don't really have any gloss on them, so I could add gloss if I wanted to. But like I said, I wanted to try something different. I like to measure my nails out so I could just go ahead and glue them on without stopping. And this is just a super easy process if you just want your nails to look cute. It comes with a file and a cuticle pusher, but I usually use mine and also... The cuticle pusher that they put in there was broken, so good thing I had my own. But yeah, it's super self-explanatory, so let's go ahead and finish these nails. This is why I love press-ons because you can get salon quality from the comfort of your home. Go get you some press-ons and save you some money. So let's get into my shower routine. I pretty much use the same products, but I wanted to try this King Fisher body wash and it smells so good. It is a men's body wash, but it's vanilla and I feel like it's unisex. So go grab you it. It's only $4 at Walmart. Then I use my Panoxyl only for my back. I do have a little bit of back knee, so this helps with that. I got my Puma Stone. If you know, you know, these heels are screaming, baby. I needed a Puma Stone, so I got me one. And then for my holy grail, I use this Dove Bar Soap. They can never make me hate you, okay? I feel so clean when I use this, as well as my exfoliating gloves. I just feel so clean when I use both of these together. So I use my Dove. And then I use my scented body wash and it just makes me feel so clean and smell so good.
I keep it pretty simple when it comes to my body care. I use this EOS lotion that I've had for a minute and also this cocoa butter from Palmer's and it really moisturizes my skin when I use them together and I smell good. I don't wear too much makeup, but when I do, I use these Neutrogena makeup wipes and I just needed to get some mascara off my eyes before I went in with my Panoxyl face wash. I do battle with hormonal acne and, and also acne scars, so this really helps minimize my breakouts and help fade my dark marks. For my moisturizer, I just go in with this simple SPF of moisturizer. And I want it to smell good tonight, so I used my Givenchy Irresistible Lotion just to give me a little more scent. I've literally been on TikTok too much because what is a sleepy girl mocktail? So the girls are saying this helps you sleep, but... It's not really going to help me sleep because I didn't put the magnesium that you're supposed to put in it. But it was a really good drink. I never tried tart cherry juice and it actually tasted really good mixed with this poppy. You can pretty much use any poppy that you like and it's actually a good little nightcap drink. You can also add a little bit of alcohol if you wanted to. Alright babe, so I'm gonna find me a show to watch, relax a little bit because these kids have me going all day every day. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe and I'll see y'all on the next one. Bye!